Baxter is a collaborative robot that's not meant to work behind a cage. It's, it's meant to work safely around humans. It's meant to do mundane, repetitive tasks that can introduce carpal tunnel to a, to a human. We'll let Baxter do those jobs and then the human can be more productive for, for the company. There's no pro, uh, programming involved. You simply train it by moving the arm and it's gonna mimic the, that movement. And it's, it, like I said, it's very, it's very easy to use. You don't need a bachelor's de degree to train it. We have line workers, assembly workers that, that train Baxter and then become a Baxter expert so they can maintain and, tra and train Baxter new tasks and they, they know how to operate, operate it and they become the go-to in that manufacturing facility when it, when it comes to Baxter questions. So for this task, we want to move the ring from here to the pegboard. It's real easy to do. I'm going to show you how to do it. First thing we're going to do is we're going to move the scroll wheel over to new. I'm going to grab the cuff, bring it down to the ring, press the long button to close the gripper. It, the head nodded and it acknowledged that it had an item in the hand. So now I'm going to move it over to the pegboard. It's going to grab the arm and move it over. When I get to an area that I like, I'm going to hit the long button again to release the part and Baxter acknowledged the, that he dropped the part, so now we're at a place uh, location. So to run that, I'm just gonna bring the part back. I'm gonna back out and hit reset. And that's it. Well, before a lot of the robots, they cost $100,000 and a lot of the small manufacturing uh, companies couldn't afford a, a robot. But, well, with starting at $25,000, Baxter is affordable and a lot of companies see profit within the first year of owning Baxter. And it's great because you can have many tasks saved on Baxter and you can have Baxter maybe on assembly line for a month and then when that assembly process is done, you can wheel it over to another assembly line, retrain it, and then it, it can run for as long as, as you desire. Where other robots would take three to six months for deploy, you could have Baxter deployed in, in, a, in a day, two days, or, or three days.